and a blurred visage, her bare feet scarred, agony embracing her figure. And there was only one response, that of the howl she let out. The colors of her beauty gradually ashen, as the impersonal world never ceased their acts of cruelty. The waves of her agony echoed through the courts, but the monsters of her fate paid no heed. The monsters who snatched away the pretty green and the calm blue, the burning yellow and the sweet pink, the menaces who dumped the resources, they who did not halt before destroying the air they breathe. Those were none other than the dominators of this world, the humans. Never did they once hesitate before strangling the throat of the one that bore them. Fire upon these obstinate beings who bear no shame. Do these hands not shake as they kill yet another flora of this earth? Do they not waver as they put an end to this mesmerizing fauna? Tarry, you heinous creatures, this place no more remains the Garden of Eden. Rather, the world of Hades slowly takes over. Open your eyes and look back at what has become of this once shining beauty. Hold her falling figure. Oh, don't let it fade. Dismiss this gloominess that lies ahead. The destruction of this creation. Good Lord, enlighten these unknowns as the region, reason of their origin is threatened. Let the dark evil depart so that the sweet prosperity reigns. That's the only one planet having life in this universe. We should respect and maintain everything we get from our mother Earth.
give you fruits. I am a tree, I give you medicine. I am a tree, I give you oxygen. I am a tree, I give you environment.